Ghulam Murtaza Syed Sindhi, Ghulam Murt D. Sid January 17, 1904 April 25, 1995, known as G. M. Syed was a prominent Sindhi politician, who is infamously known for his scholarly work, passing only constitutional resolution in favour of the establishment of Pakistan from British Sindh Assembly which is now Sindh Assembly in 1943, proposing ideological groundwork for separate Sindhi identity and laying the foundations of Sindhudesh movement. He is regarded as one of the founding fathers of modern Sindhi nationalism. G. M. Syed started his political career at the age of 16, when he organized Khilafat Conference at his hometown, San, on 17 March 1920. He was first to become a political prisoner after the creation of Pakistan in 1948. He restated the political implementation of Sufi ideologies proposing peaceful religious coexistence, secularism, Sindhi nationalism and laid the basis for Sindhudesh movement. He spent approximately 30 years of his life in imprisonment and house arrests for opposing the anti-Sindh policies. He was entitled as the prisoner of conscience by Amnesty International in 1995. He died during his house arrest in Karachi on April 25, 1995. Early life <inaudible> <inaudible> Childhood, 1904–15 G. M. Syed was born to the Sadat family of Sindh in the town of San on 17 January 1904. Syed was an infant when his father Syed Muhammad Shah Qazmi was killed due to a family feud on 1 November 1905. After the death of his father, Syed was the only male infant in the family, therefore in 1906 the British government took his family property in its custody and his family was given the monthly pension by the Court of Wards. He was admitted to a primary school at the age of six and completed his five years of primary education in Sindhi, in the year 1915. The female elders of his family decided to home school him in order to safeguard him from family feud and enmity as he was the only male heir in the family. He was taught Persian and English at home. <laughs> Teenage, 1920–24 G. M. Syed started his politics from participating in the Khilafat movement. He first attended Khilafat Conference held on 7, 8, and 9 February 1920 in Larkana. He was inspired by the speeches of Abul Kalam Azad, Abdul Bari Farangi Mahali, Maulana Shakat Ali and Sheikh Abdul Majid Sindhi. He himself called upon the next Khilafat Conference on 17 March 1920 in his hometown San. Two days after this conference, his native town San observed a shutter-down strike in protest against the injustices of the Allied powers against the Ottoman Caliphate on March 20, 1920. He remained active throughout the entire Khilafat movement afterward. He addressed the Khilafat conference held on March 26, 1920, in Makhdoom Balawal's mausoleum as the youngest speaker. He was of a short height and stood upon a wooden chair to be visible to the audience during his speech. He met Mahatma Gandhi on 27 April 1921 at the San Railway Station while Mr. Gandhi was travelling from Dadu to Hyderabad. Gandhi instructed him to wear khadi. Syed visited the office of the collector in Karachi on 23 June 1921 to free his lands from the custody of Court of Wards but he was refused. He filed a complaint against the collector and Mukhtiarkar on 4 December 1922, for hurtling the delivery of his lands from custody. Finally, he was awarded his lands back from the custody of Court of Wards in the year 1924, after two years of legal prosecution. <laughs> Political activism Syed was the founder of Sindh Awami Mahaz, which went on to join the National Awami Party, National People's Party. Like Ibrahim Joyo, Syed blended Sindhi nationalism with communism and Sufism through the ideas of Gandhi and Marx. Syed's position brought him ample opportunity to have free income through tributes, cash offerings and landed property. This lifestyle was rejected by him, subsequently he plunged into politics with enthusiasm. Politically, he evolved and travelled from pan-Islamist to Indian nationalist and then Pakistani nationalist, having joined Muslim League, and ended with being a Sindhi nationalist.
Topic: <laughs> AV school. In the early 1920s, Syed opened Anglo Vernacular AV school in his village San, where education for certain language classes was free of cost. AV school offered combo of Sindhi education with English language. The school also offered options of Arabic, French and Persian languages. Prominent Sindhi educationist Ibrahim Joyo was also schooled at Avenue. Timeline. At the early age of 14 years, Syed started his career as an activist. In 1919, became chairman of the school board of his own TESOL. He later became its president. In 1929, was elected as a president of Karachi District Local Board. In 1930, organized the Sindh Hari Peasants Conference and became its secretary. In 1937, was for the first time elected a member of Sindh Legislative Assembly. In 1938, joined the All India Muslim League. In 1940, he became Minister of Education in Sindh. In 1941, became one of the members of the Central Committee of the Muslim League. In 1943, became President of the Sindh Muslim League. In 1946, conditions compelled him to dissociate from the Muslim League, and formed a new party named the Progressive Muslim League. The same year, he was elected as leader of the coalition party in the Sindh Assembly. In 1954, acted as chairman of Sindhi Adabi Board. In 1955, played an active part in the formation of the Pakistan National Party. In 1966, founded Buzma e Sufia e Sindh. In 1969, formed the Sindh United Front. In 1972, formed G Sindh Kami Mahas. Topic: G Sindh movement. Syed was the architect of J I Y E Sindh movement, aimed at achieving Sindhudash. He is also the author of more than 60 books, with subjects ranging from politics, religion, culture, literature, and commentaries on famous poet Shah Abdul Latif Bitte. For his part as a political thinker, literary figure and mystic, he dominated the political arena of pre- and post-partition era for decades, while he remained in jail for 30 years. On 19 January 1992, Syed was put under house arrest, his house was declared a sub-jail. He died on 25 April 1995. Reception Syed was revered by his supporters as Sayan. Sayan, a son of Syed Muhammad Shah Qazmi, descendant of a famous saint of Sin Syed Haider Shah Qazmi, of whose mausoleum he was the Sajada Nashan. Syed is revered as the pioneer of the Sindhudesh movement based on Sindhi ethno nationalism. Earlier in his political career, he supported the creation of Pakistan and had in fact lobbied and passed the bill for the creation of Pakistan in the Sindh Assembly under the British Raj in India. The Pakistani states descend into militaristic national traditions and right-wing Islamist ideology along with its half-hearted commitment to the principles of provincial autonomy and federalism. Syed disowned his previously upheld idea of Pakistan. The separation of the eastern wing of the country under the Bangabandhu movement led by Sheikh Mujibur Rahman for the liberation of Bengali Pakistanis on the basis of Bengali nationalism, further strengthened Syed's belief in the unsustainable nature of the Pakistani nationhood which was based on religion alone and promoted cultural and linguistic centralization. His campaign for sin for 74 years during which he was imprisoned, house arrested and denounced and declared a threat to the integrity and existence of Pakistan. Bibliography Syed was the author of more than 60 books, written mainly in Sindhi, but also English and Urdu. His works are on numerous subjects, ranging from literature to politics, religion and culture. 
Due to his breadth of knowledge, he has been described by the Dutch scholar of Islam Oscar Verkaik as in many ways a remarkably productive, original, and largely autodidact intellectual, creating his own personal interpretation of Islam out of a range of intellectual influences such as 19th century Islamic reform, Darwinian evolution theory, theosophy, 18th century Sindhi poetry, Marxism, classical Sufism, German idealism, and probably more. Some of his well known books are Janam Guzarium Jin Sign, Sindhi. Dayar Dil Dastan Em Uhabt, Sindhi. Sind Ya Sorma, Sindhi. Sin Speaks, English. Struggle for New Sind, English. Religion and Reality, English. Shah Latif's Message, English. A Nation in Chains, English. Topic. See also. Abdul Wahid Arasar Bashir Ahmed Qureshi G. M. Syed Edifice Shafi Muhammad Burfat Riaz Chandio